there it is our very first great white shark hey guys welcome back to the channel with your boy anthony here and today i will be teaching you on how to get yourself a great white shark in coral island which is super duper important because first they're hard to catch and second they're very expensive and you can farm them the whole day and get a lot of money from it okay so let's get right to the guy so what you want to do first is you want to go to Zara's boat, yeah, over here. I'm already in the area of Zara's boat. It's located on the right side most of Coral Island of the town that you're in. I mean, the town is not called Coral Island, but you know what I mean, right? So once you're there, you have to make sure that it's during summer and yeah it mustn't be raining on that day yeah it doesn't have to be sunny but as long as it doesn't rain then you can get yourself some shark and make sure that the time is uh before sundown right so you don't want to do it after 6 p.m you know you want to do it before 6 p.m so anywhere over here this is usually where i go to s uh do some shark fishing and before we actually start doing some shark fishing i would like to give you some tips yeah the great white shark is actually very hard to capture like they struggle a lot and the waves fulfill super duper fast so my tip for you is that when the fish is struggling don't tap too much on your mouse like maybe like do two little taps you know like click 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 something like that and then as the fish struggle you will keep on doing that like tap 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 and please be careful of course not to actually let the wave gauge fulfill until it's full and then when the fish actually stops struggling what you want to do is to let the waves get smaller first almost until it's nothing before you start pressing on it so that the next time it struggles the wave is not that big that you can actually um lose it and suddenly when you press it and even though it's multiple clicks you will break it right so that is what you want to do and now i will show you how to actually do it our first shark okay see if you look like that i do two small taps and then i will let it die down first and if you see I'm not gonna lose the fish guys because uh, even though it lowers a lot when you only tap it twice you will still have a chance to get it so don't worry see if you see it's slowly raising right the bar I let it go down first before I further click it Okay, I wanna let it go down first. Let it go down and then press. 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 Let it go down and press. I just need one more. Oh my god, I almost failed over there. You have to be patient guys even though it's close don't get greedy because you have to actually repeat this multiple of times before you can actually get your great white shark there it is our very first great white shark okay and if you see right here the great white shark is going to sell for 845 corals and it's just such a huge amount imagine this is still very early it's still 10 a.m and before it actually goes sundown which is 6 p.m you can at least like catch one or two more which means that in a day you can get up to three great white sharks and maybe if you're skillful you can get up to four and imagine just how much money is that you can get around like 2000 corals in a day which is such a huge amount while you actually wait for your crops to grow right okay so that is it for today's guide if you actually enjoyed the video please don't forget to give it a thumbs up subscribe to me and turn on your notifications so you don't miss any future content from me see you and goodbye